so I guess we should start. Uh, by the way, we appear to have a bouncy ball here. Did someone put that there? That was the demo from the previous one? Okay. And this thing? The intersection of a cylinder and a sphere. Okay. I was thinking I have YouTube on my mind. It looks sort of like a tube. <laughs> I didn't know if someone put that there for some reason. Anyway, maybe I shouldn't put that there. There we go. Get that out of the way. Um, anyone want to play with the ball? Yes, you do. fun. You want it? So does that seem Markov to you? <laughs> I guess I don't care about where the exact path that it took. I, kept, I don't care just where it is, though. We also care about the velocity and momentum and everything. Anyway, that was fun because it makes a huge difference as far as finding the stationary distribution and what this chain is going to look like. So this uh, chessboard problem is just a special case of random walk on an undirected graph. Yeah. Right? Uh -huh. so Hello, Professor Blitzstein. <laughs> Hello. I take you to the candy shop. <laughs> I let you lick the lollipop. Go ahead, girl, don't you stop. Why is it doing that? Why is it doing that? Why is it doing that? Yeah. Yes, Joe, why is it? <laughs> Smile, Professor. You will be on YouTube tonight. <laughs> By the way, have you noticed that the probability of such a musical interlude is approaching a normal zero one distribution? <laughs> I'm not sure if the central limit theorem applies here. Okay. Someone is quite good at the technical stuff. Um, oh, okay. Um, I don't know how to top myself. Okay. All right. I will nervously proceed. Um, yeah, so let's, ke let's keep an eye out on YouTube. <laughs> All right. So, random walk on an undirected graph. Instead of directly solving it, which is not so bad, we're losing students because it's getting boring after, you know, it's very hard to follow up from the cosmic songs. <laughs> um, all right. But anyway, I'll show you a neat trick for finding the stationary distribution as, as the number of dimensions increases. Anyway, it's the same idea as this, but just messier asymptotics, messier sums. OK, so the. Ich hab mein Herz in Heidelberg verloren. 
In einer lauen Sommernacht Ich war für dich bis über beide Ohren Und wie ein Röslein hat ihr Mund gelangt Und als wir Abschied nahmen vor den Toren Beim letzten Kuss, da hab ich klar erkannt Dass sich mein Herz...